All about Chihuahuas The Chihuahua dog breed's charm includes their small size, big personality, and various coat types and colors. Chihuahuas are loyal, friendly, and good family pets when treated respectfully. They are also smart and caring little creatures and are beloved by owners around the world for their unique appearance and entertaining attitudes. Now let's look at everything you absolutely need to know about this breed. Number 1. Their Origins A national symbol of Mexico, these alert and somewhat amusing purse dogs are actually amongst the oldest breeds of the Americas, with the lineage reported to go back to the ancient kingdoms of pre-Columbian times. The actual history of the Chihuahua has been debated for a long time, and two main theories exist. One idea is that a small hairless breed of dog from China was brought to Mexico by Spanish traders and then later crossed with small native dogs. Some even postulate that perhaps Christopher Columbus played a role somewhere. While this could be the origin of the short-haired chihuahuas, the long-haired variety would have probably been created through crosses with things like Pomeranians or Papillons. The second theory is that chihuahuas are instead descended from a native Central or South American dog known as the Tichichi. This is essentially a larger version of the Chihuahua dating all the way back to the 9th century and the Toltec civilization. The Toltecs were a people conquered by the Aztecs, who then raised the Tachichi dog to a prominent place in their own society, as they believed these dogs had mystic powers such as the ability to heal the sick, see the future, and even guide the souls of the dead to the underworld. Evidence suggests that the Tachichi dogs lived in temples and were a part of many rituals. They were also buried alongside the human dead. However, after the Spanish conquered the Aztecs in the late 1500s, the Tachichi dog quickly vanished into obscurity. Yet these dogs lived on in remote villages, and when their descendants were eventually discovered by Americans visiting Mexico in the 1800s, they were found mainly in the state of Chihuahua, in turn giving us the name we know these tiny dogs by today. Regardless of which story is true, what we do know is that likenesses of Chihuahuas are painted all over artifacts from ancient times. Yet, the first American Kennel Club registered Chihuahua, Pepe, was not recorded in 1908. The breed did gain a lot more popularity as pets during the 1930s, 1940s, and 1950s, with some help from a musician and band leader named Xavier Cougat, who would famously hold a Chihuahua in one hand while performing. In modern day, this breed can often be seen in the hands of celebrities from around the world and have become somewhat of a Hollywood icon themselves. Number 2. Their Personality Lap dogs through and through, chihuahuas can't get enough time with their people. If they aren't snuggled up with you, they may well be found curled up in a corner or cuddled up under a blanket, net, or they will find a spot of sun to bask in. Chihuahuas have large personalities, but range from feisty and outgoing to shy and timid. They are intelligent and fiercely loyal to the people they love and are happy to accompany their owners anywhere and everywhere. However, they are prone to separation anxiety, so they are happy with people around all the time. As they act like a big dog in a small dog's body, chihuahuas can be overprotective and very vocal if not well socialized. Chihuahuas are also excellent companion dogs. They enjoy lots of attention and are very loyal to their owners. Also, even though they are considered lap dogs, they are pretty active and like to be kept occupied. Usually, chihuahuas bond to an individual person, although they will begin to warm up to others once properly introduced, but they will only do so on their own timeline. Number 3. Their Appearance the Chihuahua is a balanced, graceful dog with an almost terrier-like demeanor. They can weigh as little as 2 pounds and rarely are more than 6 pounds. Their height at withers is generally between 6 to 9 inches. There are also two types based on their coat texture. One type has a long, soft, flat, or somewhat wavy coat, and the other type has a short, smooth, glossy coat. These coats come in black and tan, red, fawn, tricolored, sable, and brindle. The most notable feature is their round heads and eyes, which are quite protruding. Lastly, the ears are large and their curved tail loops over the back. Do you like this video? If so, it would make our day if you would subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you don't miss new videos and can learn more about dogs every day. Number 4. Their Trainability Chihuahuas have the largest brains compared to their body size of any dog. They're clever little dogs as well and love to learn. Chihuahuas also seem well aware of how cute they are and often find ways to get what they want. They can have a bit of a terrier temperament so a firm but gentle hand is necessary, yet they still tend to excel in obedience training and other canine sports. Number 5. The Time Investment Needed They might be small, but chihuahuas still love getting out and about, though they don't need as much exercise as larger breeds. Chihuahuas are also surprisingly low maintenance on the grooming front. A weekly brush for short-haired ones and two to three times per week for long-haired chihuahuas should be more than enough. 
they will be happy to snooze on your lap the rest of the time. What's more, if you don't like taking the dog out on freezing winter days, chihuahuas are perfect since they can actually be taught to use a litter box like a cat. However, when you do take them out to get some exercise or do their business, don't leave them alone in the yard. They are small enough to be attacked by some birds of prey and other larger mammals. Overall, they make good urban dwelling dogs and won't take up much time on the day to day. Number 6. The Cost of Ownership The average price of a Chihuahua puppy can range from $400 to $1,500. This varies depending on the type, breeder's reputation, and bloodline. Rescue dogs are cheaper, with the adoption fees being between $150 to $600. Regardless, those from champion lines are much more sought after and expensive. Also, long-haired chihuahuas and the rarity of coat color impact the pricing. For instance, the Merle Chihuahua may cost up to $10,000. And this is before you get to the setup costs, insurance, and grooming and care bills averaging at $70 a month, which adds up when they will likely live for over a decade. However, their small size does save you a lot of food bills. So what do you think of chihuahuas so far? Stay tuned for more and let us know in the comments or share your thoughts with other enthusiasts. If you are interested in other dog breeds, check out some of our playlists and discover even more information about dogs. Number 7. Their Health These tiny pups are typically a pretty healthy breed, but they may develop issues as they age. Like many other purebred dogs, chihuahuas are prone to certain health conditions related to their breed. This is normally seen in joint problems such as their kneecaps slipping temporarily out of place or their hip joints not fitting together perfectly, eventually leading to arthritis. What's more, due to the shape of their jaws, they can retain puppy teeth and so experience overcrowding. The good news is that chihuahuas also tend to live about 11 to 14 years on average, so they are long-term companions. Number 8. The Best Home for Them Thanks to their small size, chihuahuas make ideal pets for apartment dwellers or those in smaller homes. It's worth noting that as sweet and charming as they are with their owners, these feisty little dogs can be suspicious of humans they don't know. Moreover, chihuahuas are small and lightweight, so they are very tempting for young kids to pick up and play with which they won't enjoy much. This means they're better suited to families with older children who understand that they may not want to be handled or fussed all the time. Additionally, chihuahuas have an independent streak, so they are better suited to owners with experience of training willful dogs. Overall though, they're very adaptable and well suited to urban living, so will be happy in really any household.